Mike, what have been some of the cultural challenges at Abbott as you've been trying to get people to um, see this big picture and the need to address structured data systems, both from the IT perspective as well as the business user as well as legal and records? Well, you know, anytime you ask folks to do more work, it's like, I'm busy enough, I'm not looking for any more work. Uh, so part of it is to convince them that it is a, it's a compliance initiative, it's not an option. Um, but, you know, at the end of the day, folks do want to do the right thing, and there is an, obviously an awareness that we are, you know, um, needing to get rid of some content because we clearly are over-retaining. To Kevin's earlier point, you know, if we weren't over retaining, we wouldn't be sitting here now trying to figure this out together, right? And, and, and talking with each other. But um, so the way we've kind of handled it is uh, we brought in an external firm, actually, Gimmel Group, and Karen Strong's here. And she did an absolutely amazing job for us to help put together a change management strategy for how we're going to roll this out. And I know uh, Bruce Miller yesterday, anybody attended Bruce Miller's discussion? few of you. He mentioned in there about roughly 70% towards change management. You likely will not get any funding for a single system if you think you're going to get 70% of your budget for change management. So don't go there. Um, I know we wouldn't anyway. Um, I would probably even get 30%. Um, but the fact of the matter is, uh, obviously through education, training, awareness, uh, that are all very key. And for structured um, our culture has been we work through the IT organizations who in turn work with the businesses. What we do to manage that is we work with both of them. So we don't necessarily train the trainer with the IT groups. We sit with them and their business folks. Once they've been through the process a couple of times, consider themselves trained, and then they can actually pick the ball up for that next system and already know what they need to do to be compliant. So having those you know, training, awareness, communications, understanding your audiences, your target audiences, business and IT think differently, so your communications have to be structured different. You have to understand who your audience is and what the message is going to be at any level in the organization. So it's really like a matrix you have to figure out who you're going to talk to and what it is you're going to say to them. So it is a lot of work to do that. But, um, you know, we had a lot of help, and that's really the way to go is bring that expertise in to help you figure out what is right for your particular culture, because what we did may not necessarily be needed at your particular company. Yeah, that's an excellent point.